It is the 4th of July in the Eastern Mediterranean Sea, the day we celebrate our nation's independence. In the 240 years since America declared its independence, and the people of the 13 colonies vowed to defend that declaration with their lives if necessary, it has become a day typically dedicated to family gatherings, barbecues, parades, and fireworks. In the midst of these festivities, the true reason for celebrating this day is sometimes lost. But I assure you, that is not the case for the men and women serving on board USS Dwight D. Eisenhower. A total of 56 signed the Declaration of Independence, and now more than 5,200 sailors on this mighty warship will honor them and the freedom they fought and died for by defending that document and everything it stands for. To our families, friends, and supporters, know that the men and women on board Ike, like many of their fathers, mothers, and grandparents before them, are dedicated to protecting you and the American way of life. I marvel at what I see from them every day. They rise before first light and relieve the watch. They persevere through the long days and the longer nights, resolved to deter and defeat the enemy when necessary. They stand the watch with professionalism and without hesitation. They work together and find that their greatest strength comes from those that stand next to them, whether that be in the propulsion plant, the magazines, the work centers, the galley, on the flight deck, or in the cockpit. As their captain, I am humbled each day by their sacrifice and proud beyond words of their accomplishments. I am equally awestruck by the unwavering support we receive from back home, without which we could never succeed in our mission. It is my greatest wish that you, our families and friends, honor the dedication of your sailors by enjoying your 4th of July celebrations to the fullest. Celebrate this day and rest safe in the knowledge that the sailors of USS Dwight D. Eisenhower have the watch and we will never waver in the fight.